Good afternoon and thank you for joining me again for another video tea review from LaneySips.com. Today I'm going to be reviewing a tea that's actually not a tea. It is the Chocolate Mint Truffle Tisan from Mighty Leaf Teas and it is called a Tisan or an herbal tea because it is not made from Camellia sinensis, which is the plant that true tea is made of, uh, made from. Instead, it is made from an herb called rooibos, which I believe only grows in South Africa. I recently wrote an article on it on my blog, and has become a very, very popular tisan or herbal tea in the United States. I'm assuming it has become popular elsewhere, but it is popular because it has a naturally sweet taste, it has no caffeine, and has very low tannin levels. People who have digestive problems can't handle tan high tannin levels or people who really just need to avoid all caffeine can drink rooibos and really enjoy it. It has a nice robust naturally sweet flavor and it is it brews up to a nice toasty reddish brown color it's very comforting as a hot drink so it makes a great tea substitute it also v blends very well with other flavors which is why I'm sure Mighty Leaf chose chocolate mint truffle uh, to go along with this naturally sweet rooibos uh, tisan. And Mighty Leaf is an interesting company. Let me just have a little bit of this before it gets cold. Mm. It is so good. Mighty Leaf is an interesting company. You can certainly get loose leaf teas from them, but they've also designed an interesting little tea bag, or they call this a tea pouch. It is see-through, as you can see, and it contains, it's large and roomy enough to contain leaf tea in it. It is made from a cornstarch based nylon, so it's not a petroleum based nylon. It is stitched up. It's very carefully stitched up. I believe there are no adhesives used in this. It's got a nice little tea string. And this little tag here actually gives you the name of the tea or tisan, as well as the recommended uh, steep time, which is. Eh, quite convenient. Um, this incidentally is not the uh, tea bag I use to make my chocolate mint truffle. This is actually their organic Earl Grey. Um, I ran out of the tea bags for the chocolate mint truffle. So this tea uh, or tisan is flavored with mint and uh, cocoa nibs and the rooibos. And when you smell it, the mint tends to dominate. Anything that I've ever had where there's mint, the mint will always dominate. It's a very dominant note in any fragrance or flavor. There is some chocolate and even some honey in the background, which would obviously come from the rooibos. It's got a lovely um, minty, mint forward flavor. The chocolate notes or the cocoa notes are more retiring in the back. There's a little bit of honey there. I have found that when teas or tisans with sweet notes are piping, piping hot, really hot, um, those sweet notes don't always emerge right away. They tend to emerge when they've cooled down a little bit. It is not an overly sweet tea. It doesn't have any sugar or added sweetening to it. So I would recommend trying it, and if you feel like it needs some sweetening, certainly add it. I actually think it's just fine on its own. It curbs sweet cravings well, it curbs chocolate cravings well, and uh, I think it's just, you know, just a really, really tasty uh, tea or tisan. But you could certainly add some, some milk or some sweetening to it and make a really delicious, almost cocoa-like beverage with it. I know that we are in the middle of a very cold winter here. People are looking for nice, comforting, hot drinks. And I think just might fit the bill for a lot of people. So in any case, I want to thank you for tuning in today. And I look forward to doing more of these videos for you. Take care.